Right guys, so these are some of the knives. Um, I'm gonna take down to the knife amnesty. So that top one says cheese knife, hand forged, uh, I Wilson, Sycamore Street, Sheffield, England, stainless. That's an absolute weapon, that's not really got an edge on it, but yeah, the chopper, that was got out by Tracer, Howard. Uh, the chopper I got out two weeks ago. That's like the dirty side. The other side, pretty pristine. And then this little kitchen knife, stainless steel. It's got a bit of a bend in it. But yeah, the next clip you see will be me at the local police station putting them in the amnesty box. Right guys, it's Sunday, we're out, we're in Walsall. Right, so, I'm here, to the left of me, at the minute, we've got the baits, uh, we've got Tim, and we've got Bill. Spin round, not in my car, Mike's giving me another lift again today, so I've only got my little basket. This side of me, we've got a bent over stay. Hey! Blackpool Magnet is. So oh, we'll just walk down and see who's here at the minute, get people to introduce themselves and all that. So we walk this way, we've got some more people from the Northwest crew. We've got Mike. Morning. We've got Sue. Morning. Oh get past them. We've got a load of reeds there and stuff, so nobody wants to fish this bit. So we've got this chap here, you yeah, alright buddy? Oh, mate, got to introduce mate. yourself. I'm Neil, I'm with Sonic. So you're a friend of Sonic's? Yeah. No worries. Then we have the man himself, it's Sonic. <laughs> oh, he's a bit busy at the minute, there we go. <laughs> Say morning Dave. Morning mate, how's it going everybody? There we go, adventures ding, with Sonic. Ding. Yep, ding ding. Ding ding. Do you want to introduce yourself, pal? Hello, mate. It's Duncan here. Duncan. No worries. Not bad yourself. <laughs> there we go. More Northwest crew. We've got Alan. Yeah. We've got the dog. We'll have that running. <laughs> yeah. We've got Tracer. Yeah. So, if you come this way. Do you want to introduce yourself, pal, before you go past? I'm here, Sonic's brother. Okay. No worries, oh, Sonic's got a crew out today as well, look at that. Yeah, I come from St. Albans. Bloody hell, that's a uh, little two, mooch, two, isn't it? Two hour drive. Whoosh. <laughs> yeah. Why not? Yeah. So, we've got Mr. Dippers and Scrappers. How are you? There we go. Come on, come on. Say it. Come on. Come on. There we go. We've got JD. You alright? Alright, so here we've got Nigel. No offence, we've got the crane and we've got someone coming through. We've got Sonic's missus, you alright? Yeah. Carry on up here. We've got Vinner, uh, we've got Martin, Peterborough Magnet Fishing, we've got Vinner, Drag the Mag, we've got Ruster, we've got Glenn, Peaky Dippers. Hello! You alright? It is. We'll carry on up this way. We've got Marie with purple hair, look at that! Yeah. Epic. <laughs> Yeah. All right, yeah. so we've got Ander oh, yeah. and William from Leeds Magnetors. Oh. You all right, chaps? Oh, yeah. Right. Oh. 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 Is, it, is that deep enough for you, Nicola? <laughs> 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 
So we've got some of the lads from Wales here. We've got Darren, you all right? We've got Paul. What's your, what's your name, Paul? Bobby Yam Yam. Bobby Yam Yam, I've seen yeah. that one. Desert Magnificent. There we go. Oh. I'll carry on up here. We're doing, we're doing that average as well. Yeah. Uh, Everybody knows this lad. Everybody knows this lad. How's it going? Hey, the Northwest crew are out again. We've come travelling today. We've done 120,000 miles to get here. And we're going to be beating these locals and getting all the stuff out the canals for them. <laughs> right, carry on. Okay. And then we've got the organisers. We've got the magnetizer here. Yeah. And then right down at this end, we've got Mr. Splosh Magnets. Say hello, Splosh. Hello, Splosh. <laughs> so there we go, that, that's the people who's here at the minute. We decided to come down here today to give these a look and lift. It's a lazy. <laughs> so, yeah, more people turning up. It's somewhere 20 past nine at the minute. We're expecting some more from the Northwest crew. Probably more from all over the country, to be honest. So, yeah, if I see anybody else that I've not introduced yet, we'll get an hello to them as well. Bring you back when I'm dipping. Right, so first pull, I've got what looks like a mooring pin and a little bit of a bike, mud guard maybe, uh, can lid. Tell you what though, tell you in Birmingham, it chuffing stinks. Absolutely putrid. Uh, this is all just reeds and all the rest of it. A little bit of a metal spike there. Another little one. So yeah, I'll try and get that off. And what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to give that to Magnet Man Mike. Because he asked me if I had a spare this morning. So he's going to have that in a minute. Right, so on this one, a nice six foot piece of scaffold. Probably off a handrail or something. See on the end there, it's got a nice corner piece to it. Right, there we go, the work of a collab. <laughs> Two lads from the Magnetiers, we've got Mike, we've got Steve, we've got myself. State of that shopping trolley. My Evo got absolutely stuck to it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if only you had smell of vision. Oh. But yeah, that was uh, that was good fun that was. Whew. Uh, It's a bit of a saw blade. Can. Bit more magnetic rock. But yeah, that's about it. And then over here, we've had this. I think it's remains. Seems to have like an axle at the front, axle at the back. That's about it. Nothing much in here at all. Stinks, but fairly clean. <laughs> Check this out. Check this out. We got Ryan there. Well, Luke, all right. And we got James. Good morning. In the All right, so we've moved down now. So it's mainly just Northwest crew. We've got. West and Robbie Sampler PMY, he's revealed as well. First truck here, I've got a little bit of strap bar. We've got a big piece of magnetic rock, a bit more rock, nice piece of flat plate. 
That's what it was. Got no idea what that is. Looks like it's got a bleed nipple on the end or something. Little bar. Bit more magnetic rock. It's loads of scrap by the looks of it. one we've got this big block here and on it it says current voltage regulator nice little bit of weight down there don't know how well you can see it I've got it's like the rear wheel cover off an old maybe a Vespa or a Lambretta it's got P125X wrote on it I'll google that in a bit when I get home and if I find if I can work out what it is then I'll put some info on the uh, screen Metal bar, bit of rebar probably. And oh we've got a we've got a D shackle. And just a load of rubbish. Right, so we've just moved down, what, five minutes ago? And uh there's a boat here, first one we've seen all day. Anyway, on that one, we've got whatever this is. Uh, could be back of a fuse board or something, maybe. Or a bell box, looking at that. Not sure. Bit of plastic. Looks like we've got some sort of sleeve or something. Holding that on, is this? Big metal clip. I imagine it's like some sort of scaffolding clamp. It's a nice one looking at it, to be fair, yeah. Or maybe, uh, I don't know, something like that. And just here, we've got this boat. They give you the back. No name on it. You all right? Give you the back and you get anything worth going in, like clamps or whatever. Yeah, yeah. no worries. Yeah, bit of, bit of magnetic rock. That's about it on that one. There's a boat with no name. Right, so on this one, I've got a nice wide piece of uh, flat plate. Could be off the motorbike, I don't really know. But we've got that. We've got a nice, another thick piece of rebar. Got a little bag over here for Paul. Fill that up for him. We've got, oh, could have been a gear change lever or something maybe off that bike. It's the right sort of shape with the end and everything. Maybe. Uh, half a spoon. Nail. And just a load of rubbish bits. Got a penny there, cheeky penny. So I've just had this out, it's like a, either a swing arm or a centered stand I'd say. We've had this square out, second one of them I've had. The other one's there next to it and then I've just had this out. Now I've had one of these before, in fact I think it's in my box, yep there it is. So I'm just wondering whether it's the same as that and that's like a quick release for the boats. Oh, well, could be. So on this one I've got a fishing reel, another big piece of uh, rebar and we've got this which I'm going to say, looking at that, is the seat off the motorbike. There's a latch at the back there, very nice. So we've got this here, it's got a hole in the top, it looks like it's got uh, little cutouts in, this little thing there. Got them on the bottom, couple of little like spikes. We think that's a fuel tank or something. So I'll ask Alice to have a look, see what he thinks. But might be another piece of our bike. On this one, I've got the foot pegs off the motorbike, still connected to the base plate. And by the looks of it, there's still all the crud. And I spoke to Alistair, he's just turned up whilst dragging magnets. He said, yeah, definitely a Lambretta Vespa. And that is the swing arm off it and that's more than likely going to be the petrol tank off it. So, getting it out bit by bit. There you go. 
So on this one, we've got the six foot wrecking bar. So it's flat on that end, goes to a point on that end. Good bit of weight in that. Also on there, looks like we've got a piece of rebar and another little bar with a hook on the end. Probably with some thin rebar. Nice. Okay, so on that one, ignore that little exhaust here for the bar running right down to here and on the same pull I've had this maybe looks a bit pole gold stick esque doesn't it like that um, I don't know maybe the foot or something maybe like a, a sign or something like that a nice thick piece of rebar a can top uh, that's probably about it for that one Right, so on that one I've had two good items, I've had that, which is a foot peg, probably off the bike. And on that one we've got a ring spanner, the blended ring spanner. I'm going to give it a quick clean up, see if it's the elusive 10mm, but I'd say it's a bit big, mate. Maybe 16, something like that, 17s. But, yeah, see what that is, nice little find. Alright, so that's it from us at the uh, Birmingham Club, organised by the Magnetaires. This scrap here is what's been left by the North West and dippers and scrappers, Rob, he said that he'll have it arranged to be moved by the same scrap man used today in the morning. So, obviously we was right at that bridge, which is all the way down there. Uh, but yeah, not a bad turnout at the end. Nice bit of... Uh, Motorbike bits coming out, but unfortunately, I've got to go home. Not in my car, and it is cracking on anyway. It's four o'clock, so time to go. Don't forget, if you like this video, any of the other videos, and check them out. Like and subscribe if you will, please. See you next time, everyone.